Hey guys, I have an art supply to share with you. This is the brand new Line and Wash Paint Pan Set by Derwent. And before we get started, I want to tell you a little bit about this set. It includes six ink tense colors, four graphite tint colors, and two neutral lighter shades. It also includes two black fine line markers in .3 and .8. Okay, let's get started. I am so excited. I love when a new product is released. Oh gosh, I am just gonna have to tear into this. Ooh, okay. All right, the packaging is just like all of Derwent's other little um, pan sets, except I have to get into these now. Let's see, how am I going to do this? I need scissors. I'm just going to have to get my scissors. Oh gosh, come on now. Ooh, that's really in there. Okay. All right, so first let's look at these pins. All right, so this is the larger 0.8. Guys, this feels substantial. Okay, so that's a nice thick line. And the 0.3. Okay. All right, these seem to be really good. I like these. Okay, you know what? A lot of companies are starting to include fine line uh, markers with their watercolors, and I love it. I love that they're doing that. Okay, so let's open this up. Okay, now I love that they do this. They include a little swatch card already made for you. Okay, now I'm gonna have to I'm going to have to get my scissors again. Now I'm wondering if those uh, two neutral shades that they say are included, I wonder if that's the graphite tint or the ink tints. And looking at it, it looks like they're all mixed up. Like this looks like graphite tint, but these two over here look like ink tints. I wonder if that's intentional. Probably so, because it looks like they've put all the blues together, the greens together. I think they did. So you're not going to have all of your ink tints together and your graphite tint together, they're going to be mixed up. So that's interesting. That's interesting how they did that. Okay, so you also get a water brush, which I'm not going to swatch with this. I'm going to go ahead and swatch with a number eight round uh, Princeton Aqua Elite. I'll use that. Let's get started. Okay, so I have my watercolor paper. And I'm going to get my brush wet and let's dip into this first color and this is sun yellow. Now I'm going to just show you guys what's happening. Okay, so I just dipped it in and look at all the pigment already on my brush. So it dissolves extremely quickly and this definitely looks like this is one of the ink tints colors. For sure, look at all that pigment. Oh my goodness. Okay, so if you already have the ink tints colors, if you already own the graphite tint colors, this, these are probably just going to be repeats for you. If you don't own either of the sets, this is a great set to get because you can try out a little of both. I love that. Okay, so the next color is mango. And this is an ink tense color. Beautiful. Okay. And then the next ink tense color 
is Poppy Red. It's very easy to tell which is ink tints and which is the graphy tint because the graphy tint, well, because it has graphite in it, you can really see that shine from the graphite. Okay, so the next color is called, uh, let's see, it's called Autumn Brown, and this is a graphy tint color. So this is the Autumn Brown. Oh, fabulous. That is so beautiful. Okay, the next color is called Port, and this is also a graphy tint. I'm going to try to put it right here. That is oh, so fabulous. Muted purple. It's just fantastic. I love it. Okay, our next color looks to be an ink tint, and it's called Bright Blue. Okay, the next color is called Payne's Gray, and this is one of your ink tints colors. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Now that, it, they're calling it Payne's Gray, but guys, you can use that as an indigo. It's beautiful. Okay, the next color is called Ocean Blue, and this is a graphy tint color. Oh, look how fabulous that is, guys. I love, I love Derwent's graphy tint and their ink tints. It's incredible. And guys, they just came out with their ch tinted charcoal um, in a pan set just like this. I ordered it. I pre-ordered it. It should be coming any day now. And as soon as I get it, I'm going to film a video and bring it to you guys. And that's also brand new. Okay, so the next color, this is Ink Tints, and this is called Ortichoke. Oh, I just love these colors. Each color, so fabulous. Okay. Okay, next color is a graphy tint color, and this is called Meadow. Oh. It's like a beautiful, beautiful olive green, and it's just fabulous. I love that color. Okay, now the next color, this looks, yep, this is a graphy tint, and they're calling this one um, Natural Brown. Oh, that pigment. Okay, let me clean up. I made a little mess right there just cleaning up my mess. Okay, so, and the last color, they're calling this one Storm Gray, and this looks like an ink tints color. Let me put a little bit of more water on there so I can get a nice big swatch. Okay, so that's Storm Gray. Okay, so what do I think about this new palette? I love it. I absolutely love the colors that they've put together to make this beautiful palette. I love that they're giving you the opportunity to try a little bit of the ink tints, a little bit of the graphy tint. Look how beautiful they work together. And not only that, they've included two line markers. And these are really nice line markers. These are just not some throwaway add-on that they put in here. These are the really good Derwent line markers. This is really fabulous. I highly recommend this set. It just came out. It's absolutely brand new. Go pick it up before they sell out. If you just love to collect watercolors, I mean, this is just a great set to get. But like I said, if you've never experienced Derwent ink tints or graphy tint, this is the way to try it. So beautiful. All right, guys, I hope you've enjoyed this swatch video. And as always, I will leave links below so you guys can go and check everything out for yourself. 
All right, I'll see you later. Bye.